falls is a killer, especially when you're, when you're on the same floor as the Oklahoma Sooners. Anastasia Webb, a 9.9. Maggie Nichols is in the anchor spot. Those two athletes battling it out for the all-around title is here as well. After two rotations, Maggie had a two-tenth lead over Anastasia Webb. Just needs a 9.7 here to maintain that. And Maggie is another one of those athletes that just loves to perform. She loves to get out on the floor exercise and show what she has got. Very unique first pass. One and a half step out into the double back. She's having a lot of fun out there. That's one thing KJ said about her is that coming into the last weekend's meet, she said she's never seen her happier, more relaxed, more focused, more excited beyond the gymnastics floor. And that is so refreshing. She is a senior, and she is loving every moment of this senior season. A subplot to this season is Maggie Nichols is chasing the 10-0 the record held by Jenny Hansen. Uh, she's 11 behind, but Kyla Ross is 9 behind, so we'll see how that goes over the course of the next 10 regular season meets and a couple postseason meets. Final pass for Maggie. Double pike. She knows where she is to get that stick. What a performance. And this first pass that she performed, very, very difficult. One and a half twist. Step out into a roundup back handspring, double tuck. Very nice job. And this final tumbling run, double pike, sticks that landing. Good to see Maggie back and healthy, and she is going to make things very interesting as we head into the postseason. 